All right, here we go. Welcome, Grip TV Nation. This is Friday afternoon racing. On I racing, of course. And we got an IMSA race. Now, believe it or not, I made the second split. Yeah, he made. I made managed to, to get to the second split. Samantha's going to be cheering us on. You guys are going to be placing your bets here. They're three wide to the left of me. That's not good. Uh, so I'm number five car, I start 12th. Up there, boy. All right, here we go. We're going green. I'm in the Ferrari, by the way. GTE class. It's a 45 minute race with a pit stop for fuel. Oh, they're wrecking already. <laughs> All right, picked up a couple spots, I think, already. Where those spots fell in your lap. Well, oh, yeah, I, mean, I didn't overtake anyone. I think it's a good thing to have boundaries. Stay over there. On your right. Still on the right side. You got it, buddy. Oh, that was okay. close, huh? Still there at your door. You're clear. I don't know. I think naturally in a relationship, right you gotta be like, you wanna grow you're close together, but too many people like, jump the gun. Jumping right into it. Like, if I was living with this kid already, I don't know. Put boundaries in place that way. It's like a. I, I hey, I put identity. boundaries in place too. I still have my identity. You know? I like, put up an invisible fence. We'll see each other one day during <laughs> the week and weekends. And then it provides us something to look forward to. Yeah, I don't The old uh, why why buy a cow when you're getting the milk for free? Am I right, gentlemen? Something like that. My daddy used to always say that. I just think it's nice to be married as virgins, you know. You know. Two, minute fourteen point zero. I can't one, wait to five. rub your shoulder on the honeymoon. Without this t-shirt fabric in the way. <laughs> Did you just call me a cow? No. What happened here? No, I didn't. <laughs> it's an expression. <laughs> you just snort. I'm the cow in this scenario. Stay mnemonic, Chris. Stay mnemonic. I gotta cut down the incidents. Cut Get down. the show cow Malone. <laughs> You used to show cows, didn't you? Show animals in 4-H? I Every can be one. Cow. Oh. You have to have them to show them. Oh, you showed your family pet. I don't remember. It's a dog show. Yeah. No, I've never argued. You should. Why is everyone so much better than me? hard. You have ganja protein powder in your yogurt. That's good. She better run the cow, but when she dies, we just move on to the next one. I don't know. Most things, if you're renting, ends up being more expensive in the long run. Yeah. 
Sorry, Barry. Holy crap. See, I don't see how you can display that kind One of, uh, skill. And find yourself deserving of tops. It was a near crash. Ah, oh, Matthew, it stinks in here from that last turn. You shit your pants. <laughs> <laughs> I think Barry shit his pants, not me. I didn't even realize what happened until it was over. <laughs> Do you sim race? Is the question. Huh? Can't you read chat? I'm trying. She's uh ran she's ran some laps before, nothing special. All of a sudden we're going through sunset. Whoop up up up! This guy reruns me. Who's that Malone guy? Here we go. Come on now. Positive energy. Positive vibes. Because of the sword thingy. Nothing special. Ozcast is that a joke at my expense? joke at my expense on this stream. When Matthew and I get married, I'm going to make a Mrs. Showdown. Go there. Clear. You'll see. And we'll have special guest appearances. And Matthew will have to sit his butt in this beanbag chair. And I'll still roast him. One minute fifty-eight point three. <laughs> hey Jasper, what's nine. up, dude? Okay, Samantha. You better get the username now. Oh, I have to do it with the new email account I created. Did you create? Oh yeah. Sam would make tap split. See, it's a little grippy out here, so I'm thinking I can break later and stuff, but not really.
Wait, did I wipe the corner of my mouth? In a weird way. Hey, that's a good tip, uh, Supermoto head. Probably island. I thought this was a morning stream day. It usually is because by now Matthew would be expected to report at my house for his weekend visitation time. Maybe but it was a snow day! So I came to him. Right, we're getting these fools. Let's go. Jensen, you're already talking to Kate about her last name. What else have we been discussing? I need to know. I yeah. need to know if she'll have your last name when you bring her to the wedding. Yeah, have you decided whether or not you're bringing Kate to the wedding, Jensen? It's four months away. I'll need to have that information to me. You'll have to give that to Matthew so I can write out the stuff. Uh, what do we get, like six inches of snow? Uh, well, Hans has his own thing, right? That's why I call her Samantha. Also, I've got a really convincing fan voice, so you know. We did discuss though that Matthew was gonna start referring to me as his partner, Sam, and future conversation. Yeah. My significant other, or my partner, my life partner Sam, just loves. It's like, it's, it's like a Neat. conversation. Neat, yes. All right, Ronnie Brad, it's something on Tattletail. I covered it up. David Sim Racing, thanks for the follow, man. One minute fifty seven point three eight one. Here's Nick. I don't know if Matthew's going to shave for the wedding or not. He's not going to shave right before because you can always tell someone who's shaved right before. Because there's like a sun outline. What do you guys think about that move? What, what, what do you guys think would just happen? I think, I think Nick didn't know where I was. It scared him. That inside, that was good, Barry. Left side. 
clear. Why you did that, Judge? Outside. Bring a ruler with you. That's not how you take accurate. It's got to be an average. Right side. You walk around the house. Clear, All right, clear. let's go. To make me try. Right. <laughs> right side. Inches, what? <laughs> Thanks for Thanks for the donation. <laughs> Here's a balloon. I'm so innocent. <laughs> that's how that's their that's like their uh, strategy. But you are innocent though. That's the difference in it. Just keep talking. Just <laughs> keep talking. It's true though. I'm not talking about you, I'm just saying that's, that's how those cam yep, girls do. Yep. <laughs> Macro, oh my god. How would I know this? I've done my research. Oh! Woo! This might have been an overreaction, but... I think he's taking care of that slowdown he got. One minute fifty-nine. He cut that one new part of the track. Five. We got company. Can't shake him. For someone who wanted two bags of chips, you need to eat half the bag. Three Did I get two bags? Yes. Uh, I guess it, I guess I didn't need them all. And you also weren't going every other bite with chips. You let all lie. Well. I eat differently when I'm on stream and I eat. It's weird. Yeah, I like this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> well, <laughs> it's whatever. <laughs> well, do you eat differently when you're at a nice restaurant compared to when you're stuffing pizza in your face at home in front of the TV? Of course. No. Yeah, you do. Everyone does. No one's prim and proper with their ranch sauce dripping all over their chest. The 
spare racing wheel and pedals? No, I don't have it. Welcome, Caesar. You're prim and proper at all times? Okay. Do an undercut? I think I just pass him out, right? Yeah, because there's no such thing in the food industry as dipping sauces. No. Nope. Right. You're already putting pizza sauce on the pizza. I like Western dressing on my pizza. We had a big, big impact on people. I mean, a lot of people were in the sandwich pizza. Say I'm a sellout. Sponsor. Yeah, we're going through there. Keep an eye open. We're not Stop getting it. into the pineapple and pizza. That was for position. So now the battle for fifth is right in front of us. Does Malone have what it takes to secure a top five in this second split? Second split extravaganza. <laughs> Dang it, that was close. Second split. Second split. You what, mate? It's second split. You what, mate? Setups. Did someone make a command for the uh, setup shop Discord thing? Water, please, honey. No. Is that how people talk to each other when they're married? No. Good. Say, damn, I'm thirsty. I wish somebody would fucking get up and give me some water. And then who gets some water? The robot? The man. Yeah. Yeah. One. Eight. 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 Clear him. Clear. I don't know what his strategy is there, but take him. Welcome, Toby Ashi. 
uh, honey, would you be a deer and go grab me my squatty potty? <laughs> I've got my mittens on and it's hard to grasp it. Malone, you need to use the squatty potty over the potty. I like to use it. I like to use it as a reading chair. <laughs> I cracked myself up. I think it just spun out behind you. Oh, really? Sweet. Fatality. Probably because I was going so slow. <laughs> He's like, "What's this guy doing?" Oh man, rip positive energy. He even read the book The Secret. He was thinking really good thoughts and what do you know? He failed in life. I don't know. I don't know how Oprah did it. It's a, it's a joke on that book. The Secret. If you think... Well, I didn't read the book. But if you... It supposedly... <laughs> Please if you, tell me about the book you didn't read. <laughs> if you think positive it's thoughts, nuts. like, like one day I'll be rich and I'll have my own, uh, you know, in-ground pool, and you think about it every day, like, oh man, one day I'm gonna have a Ferrari and a big mansion. If you just think that every day, it'll come true. There's no need to actually do any hard work in life to actually get what you want. You just think about it. See, that's how that works. I'm sure that's what the book said. Oh crap, I do need a box. Next, this lap. Thank you. Oh, oh issues. What's box? Uh, uh, pit stop. Why is it called box? Box this lap, box this lap, because it's your pit box. <clears throat> yeah, I already own a Ferrari. It was so easy to obtain. All I had to do is think positive. Alright, pity man. Are you really gonna block like that, dude? Dude. Yeah, bro. Yeah, bro. We came here to fucking race, didn't we? We, we came here to race, didn't we? It's like a. It's not a charity. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's my dream car? Well, Seriously. I don't really have one, but yesterday we discussed you can't the, block me, the, door the new the uh, Corvette Z06. Yeah, it is amazing. I uh, just watched Doug Nemiro's latest video, saw the Corvette, and I was like, yeah, that's probably the car that I would really want. But I usually don't think about stuff that's not possible. So, like People always fantasize, like, oh, what would you buy if you won the lottery? You'd be like, why waste your time on thinking about stuff like that? You know? My God, Alright, pity in. We called that a long time ago. I would be a sequence. It's like eighty thousand uh, macro. That's what Doug was saying. How did Demiro become a hit? It's good, informative videos, and he's kind of a character, so you know, it's good stuff. He makes good videos. Mercedes, a uh, GT3 car, they're in the slower class. You're clear. Yeah. I don't know. There's a lot of really nice, awesome cars out there, you know? If you were to 
it'd be so hard to pick just one. Like, if they were all lined up in front of you, and you're like, okay, you can have one of these epic cars. Which one would you like? Free of charge, no taxes. You don't even have to... You don't... You don't even have to pay insurance on it. It's completely free and clear, right? It would be a very difficult decision. I, I would not want to make my decision that day. I'd want to, like, sleep on it and, like, do some research. I don't know. It'd just be really hard of a decision to make. Like, do you pick something? Like, you have to think about it realistically. Like, okay. Well, yeah, I was just about to say, like, should you make it your daily driver? Are you picking something that you can go to the track with? Now you're going to be spending extra money for track time. I mean, you almost need something that's halfway practical. Why not treat yourself to luxury every day, you know? Go for that... Go for that extra storage space in your minivan, you know? We're talking about sports cars. <laughs> no, we're not. We're talking about dream cars. The dream cars is a... Uh, Chrysler Town and Country. Matthew's gonna own the minivan. I'm not. I'll drive a minivan. You think I care? They're they're amazing now. Minivans are amazing. You heard it here, folks. I don't care what people think. It's true. Matthew's owning the minivan. I'm not. I'll wear a effing fanny pack too and drive a minivan. Oh. What did you just do? Messing with the foot cam. Good thing that camera's not turned around 180 in. Follow me. Hello, chat and these two people. Hello. Hello from one of these two people. Windshield's a little dirty, huh? Am I really in third place? This can't be true. Socks with your sandals? You betcha. Still not your daughter, huh? No. I've only now secured a. Man, I better think about this sentence. Oh, here you go, <laughs> chat. You're gonna hear it's half, half worked through bit that he's prepared. Well, somebody is asking like, "Oh, this is still isn't your daughter?" And I'm yeah. just thinking like, huh? I have finally found a woman. Let's see if I was smarter, it'd be easier to form this sentence. Yeah. I've just now been able to find a woman worth bearing my seed and I'm waiting for the big uh, wedding celebration and then after that I want to find a nice home for my little swimmers <laughs> and then we're going to start a um, dynasty stop while you're ahead Matt oh too late You are worthy of my seed, woman. <laughs> awkward. <laughs> Beautiful speech. Thank you. Oh, come on. It's not awkward. Should we're just having fun. You gotta have fun in some else. Uh, <laughs> What's wrong? What's wrong? Did you hurt yourself? Or are your feelings just hurt? Eh, toughen up, kid. Yeah, we're gonna be creating a dynasty of meh. Of meh? Meh. Not tops, but just meh. Mediocrity. Woo! 
Oh, I'm in fourth. I see it now. That is, that is true. Or Falcon. That did happen. If, if his hands weren't busy on the wheel, he would do one of these. Eh? Eh? He does eh? all eh? the time. Eh? What? Stop it. <laughs> I just think it's funny. You're like, well, you know what would be good today? Some pizza. Huh? <laughs> I'm like, what does hitting my arm have to do with your comments? If people watch this, they're probably thinking like we eat pizza like every other night. <laughs> That's what well, we're talking about. Are they wrong, huh? Yeah. <laughs> they are yeah, wrong. Yeah, they would be wrong, yeah. <laughs> I wish we could have pizza every other night. Yeah, we can have our own TV show. That's kind of what I'm going for, eh? I gotta catch up to me. Well, I mean, when you're, when you're raised like this, uh, I mean. Yeah. Am I right? Huh? Huh? <laughs> yes. I'm racing pretty bad. Oh man, I'm beat. Too much break, not enough gas. One minute fifty-eight point three. Well, you three. see, Warren Falcon, when Matthew uh, tries to multitask, they both they both come out a little bit subpar, and uh, you know you just have to be okay with that. You have to accept mediocrity. And uh, you can't have any. Big expectations out there, like top split. What's that? You shut down. You you'll be crying a lot. This won't happen. Won't happen. Man, he's a good streamer. Yes. <laughs> God. He can do it all. Is that your toddler voice? Your perception of the world can be far from reality of what the actual world is. And you can live in that reality. Me Who's stopping you? Are you digging on me right now? No, I'm just saying. It's general my opinion on things. Okay. Okay, good man. We're going to be here probably about five miles. Okay, no, let's take it Five miles. Listen. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah. Sleeping through meal times, you know. I don't know how some people do it. They even fed her pretty early today. Cause I woke up at like seven o'clock or something. You want the one? Minute fifty-eight point one four eight. Well, I'd spell it out, but I can't spell it. Focus there too, so I just made a mistake. It's not a big deal. Please don't leave me. One on the right side. You're clear. Come on, Malone. Punch me in the shoulder. Yeah, do it again. Yeah, okay. That wasn't that hard enough. 
two or three, and it takes that fast, that's going to run me to get it. This just went X rated. Hey, those guys bad on for a second, they could crash. Spectacular. Gosh, it. So fun, fun fact, uh, spectacular, definitely. But our initials for the wedding, I've been putting on stuff, I have to be very strategic that it's M and S. This can't be S and M all over. Yeah, I'd much rather have it be multiple sclerosis. Did I say that right? Here, well, you you mostly feed me because I know you know this is true. Whenever we go to a restaurant and we order our food, she always ends up ordering the better of the food of the two options. So I'm always like, oh my god, that looks so good. <laughs> I'm like, that looks way better than what I ordered. Can I try some? Because I'm strategic about my meals that I'm buying. If we're at a steakhouse, what do you order? Matthew's like, I'll have the fish. <laughs> what is wrong with you? Like, you pick what the chef is. What they're known for, yeah. When we went out for my birthday, oh, I had the best with you, Wellington. And Matthew's just like, like, just salivating over it, trying to get multiple bites out of it. It's your own meal. Yeah, we go to like a, a place that makes really good you know, cheeseburgers or burgers, and I'm like, nah, I'll have the mac and cheese. Yeah. And then she gets an amazing burger, I'm like, oh man, why didn't I order the burger? I'm like, it's a burger place, Malone! And he just, he just looks at me while I'm eating. Like, he watches me eat. <laughs> I'm like, Roxy. And then, and then he's just kind of like, can I have a bite? <laughs> or like, he'll start it off by like, that looks good. And I'm like, it is. <laughs> and then he's like, can I have a bite? And then he critiques the bite I give him. No, you gotta get it all equal on there. You can't just give me that piece. It's on gotta the be head. a representative sample. No, he wants the best part of my meal. He's like, oh no, I want that that part right there, please. Can you load that up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, this is my meal. If I want to share with you the little burnt end piece, that's what you're getting. The mic doesn't move, unfortunately. Let me get you a lapel mic. They can hear you. Thank you. Can we get it just on stage? It probably just, it just sounds like it's far away because you're far away from it. Look, these, uh, you know, uh, you know, I'm trying out this whole Samantha stream thing every once in a while, you know. It's fun, you know, but, uh, you know, it's not going to be like habit forming or anything. <laughs> it's fun every once in a while, but it it wears the it wears the shit out of me. <laughs> it wears me out. I'm not gonna lie. It is a lot of fun. Though. It's probably because we're having so much fun that I get tired from laughing. Yes. <laughs> There's Malone talking and talking when he should be shutting his mouth up. But we have been live for it's gonna be almost six hours, so I guess it's a long. Heidi ho, neighborino! Mm -hmm. 
Are you gonna Are you gonna sit through the Daytona 500 again? That was only like four hours, right? It's like three. Well, it depends on the. I don't know. Days. Will Rainbow Kitty win again? But Rainbow Kitty? I don't know. Probably not. I should try to work on my eye rating a little bit for that race. Thank you. Oh, just for the race? That's with the eye rating? Oh, yeah. Like, there are standards in this relationship. When you start slipping below the standards, I'm willing to work with you for a little bit. But if you are going to just sit at that level, I've got to tell you. You, you don't know. want me to be complacent, do you? No. Well, it's oval, so it's totally separate eye rating than road. Am I gonna make it on fuel? Yes. It's okay. Although it's super close. 0.15 gallons at the end. Hey, Tokyo. I there is a nice little gaggle behind me, isn't there? Whoa, we... No, we have to get white flag coming up in order for me to make it on fuel. And there's zero time on the clock, so I would imagine yes. White flag incoming. Yeah, I barely got enough fuel. Oh, the DP leader's right behind me. Oh, don't let him pass. What's DP? Corvette Daytona prototype. The yellow one? Yeah, if he passes me right now, the race is over. Okay, good. One more lap. So those guys behind me cannot catch me no matter what, because the race is over for them, I think. Yeah, it's white flag for me right now. So I'm the last car. On the last lap. Last race, last race. And the white flag has wove. What if you crash? What if I crash right now? I get fourth place no matter what, right? Yeah, pretty sure. Or if I run out of fuel or whatever. Nobody behind, there's literally no one behind me that's racing me. They're all finished. I didn't screw myself. What are you talking about? My first day I racing. I don't know how the flags work. Well, how long ago was it that you stopped on the white flag? A long time ago. It was less than a year ago. It was within this last calendar year that you're like, I'm in first place! Look at this beautiful white flag without the black checkers oh God, in it. I won. <laughs> yeah, that was a mistake. Whoop. Oh, shit. Back in that rhythm. Get that line right. <laughs> Hey, fourth place, pretty good. I bet the bets already paid out. Fourth place and top split, that's pretty good. So there's just about what? It's not, it's not, it's not that. Alright, there are your winners. Okay. Hey. Considering uh, the circumstances, that was pretty uh, pretty good. Look at these guys wrecking right off the bat. What an idiot! What an idiot. Oh my Lanta, that guy's gotta be pissed. Thanks, Daniel. Look at the Corvette. Oh, 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 that's called tunnel vision right there. 
Happens to the best of them. Dun, 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 dun. So what do you think about the race? Yeah, We're going to do a post-race interview. Uh, you're the interviewer. You're supposed to ask questions. Ah! You be the judge. What do you want from me? Huh? Am I not here? Are you not entertained? What do you want? What do you want? Huh? 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 Look at this. Is this a dirty move? Is I'm this a dirty move? I'm in the red car. More. Tonight at night. Yes. Why? Because you're just dirty. So it's a dirty move. God, my you're freaking eye is killing me. Move. Let me teach you a little something. Uh, this is a door that is completely wide open and open for the entire neighborhood to come on in. Enjoy Grandma's apple pie. The door is wide open. You could fit four effing Ferraris right in here. This door is yeah, wide no. open. The, uh, the repair model on the Ford uh, is stuck. And I'm side by side already. Yeah. Side by side already. I didn't think of that. And uh, let's see who there. holds their line. You do. He's obviously just following yeah, the green car in front of him. Tunnel vision. Uh, yeah. But it is what it is. At least what's fun. He just turns right into me. I mean, I'm pretty... I'm giving him as, as much room as I can. I'm all the way on the yellow line. He's the one who turns into me. Yeah. I do understand the road narrows here, but... You gotta give room. It wasn't on you. Thank you. Confirmed. Hey, look at this. Look at this. So, how do you like it, Nick? Instant karma. Yes. Look, now Nick's on. Now the, now, the, now the old racing shoes on the other foot. Nick's a good guy, though. I've raced with him before. Oh, Malone going well. Yeah, guys. Bye. Oof. Good one. <laughs> Fat blue hobo. Yeah, it's tough. You're the GT that checks up right behind it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Well, that's it. Uh-oh. Something bad about to happen here? Look at the results. Okay. IMSA. Second split. Good stuff.